Okay, so I got a request about how to do tempo on this um, G200KG and the user gave me a file. So I downloaded it and what I found is that um, it's basically a ASCII version of the hex and then if I convert it, I can load it in via MIDIOX. So he asked how to use MIDIOX and this is how we do it. So you connect your pedal up first and then you select the devices. Then I think I made some mistake about not knowing where the windows are. Oh yeah, uh, 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 okay, yeah. So now what I did was I made a mistake. I downloaded the tempo and this is Windows 11. I'm not very familiar with that. So although you see the file there, it hasn't actually extracted it. So I'm gonna make a mistake and then I'm gonna come back and uh, put it into the right mode. I decided to show the mistakes because it's easier to show that we're all human, yeah. So in the MIDI devices, uh, I need to go to the view menu so I can look at SysX. So I get there eventually and I click on the SysX button and now it says you can send and receive a file. So it thinks it's in download new tempo. And when I go to look there, I can't find the file. And I can't find the file because I haven't unpacked it. I've only logically unpacked it in the window. So I, I mess around a bit trying to find it. And then I, rem I understand, look, it's a zip file. So I have to go back to Windows and unzip the file first and your mileage may vary, yeah. So we go up one and we right hand click and extract and it puts it in new tempo, new tempo dot bin. So we'll do that. And and of course, if you can just extract this file, that's so much easier. You could rename it dosisx. Maybe that would be better, yeah. Um, now I can find it, but I have to tell it to look for more than just um, sysx files, yeah. Uh, it it expects to find a, a, a certain name. So I say, okay, look for all files. I find the bin file. This has been doctored to 150. And when I do that, it says it's transferred. It took me a little while to realize, but if I go on, onto the pedal and have a look for the display, then it shows 150 as the tempo. So it's worked. I don't know what the G200KG is doing. I guess it's got a blank file where the tempo is set at the default. It loads the effects in and doesn't it overwrites. That's my guess. Anyway, uh, I hope this works. It's the first time I've tried Caden Live. If you have any more questions, please send me information and I will try and help. Okay, thank you and bye-bye.